This is a video on how to create new designs in DriveWorks Pro through the SOLIDWORKS task pane itself. A new specification can be run in the DriveWorks Pro tab of the SOLIDWORKS task pane. This offers a unique way of specifying a project inside SOLIDWORKS directly without having to use the DriveWorks administrator. While running a specification in SOLIDWORKS, the resulting model can be previewed at any stage during the specification process by using the preview button located on the command bar. This is different from the actual model generation in the following ways. The new models are issued a temporary file name until the specification is finalised, and changes to the specification will update the temporary models each time the preview button is clicked. With DriveWorks Pro open, and with a group and a project open, go to the form design task from the task explorer. The forms that have been created here will be available within the SOLIDWORKS task pane and allow you to fill them in and create new designs. Minimise DriveWorks and within SOLIDWORKS click onto the Open Group button from the command bar. With the group selected that you would like to open, click on Finish, enter in your security credentials and click on Log On. Now click on the new specification button from your command bar and select which project you would like your new project to be based on and click OK. Your specification is now open within SOLIDWORKS and you are able to work through your forms in the same way you would do with the DriveWorks Pro Administrator by filling out the form controls and hitting next to progress to the next forms. When you have finished, select release and then on the finish dialog box, hit finish. As usual, a new window will appear when the specification is finished, showing all the newly created models, drawings and documents. Within SOLIDWORKS, click on the Model Generation button located on the command bar. The DriveWorks Model Generation dialog box lists all models that are currently in the queue to be generated. To reach the Model Generation queue, a specification must have been released during specification or from the pending state in the Specification Explorer. Because the specification was generated from the SOLIDWORKS task pane, it was generated when we clicked onto the Release button. Put a check in the specification that has just been released and click on Generate to generate the reports associated with your specification. If you go back into the DriveWorks Pro Administrator and click on to Refresh, your newly created specification will be brought through into the specification list. Here you can view the documents and open up the report whilst also having the option to copy, delete and archive the specification. For more information, click on the help button anytime whilst using DriveWorks Pro, or visit the online help file which can be found at docs.driveworkspro.com.